Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. My name is Maureen and I'm happy to have you. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and feel free to leave me a comment. If you're not subscribed yet, please subscribe before you leave. And let's get right into today's video. And today's video is from a company called succulentsbox.com and they are located in California. And they reached out to me after, um, I guess, seeing me on YouTube, which was wonderful. I was so pleased when they did and asked me if I would like to receive a box for a review. And obviously I said, yes, I am a big plant lover and I am a gardener um, in the spring and summer months that allow here in my state. So um, just a little bit um, quickly before we get started. This is a subscription, uh, a monthly subscription service. Um, you can get one, two, three, or four succulents per month, depending upon you know what you choose. And they range from five to twenty dollars per month. And then they do have three, six, and twelve month prepay options, where I believe if you do that, you save uh, an additional five percent by pe prepaying. And they do have an option that is one air plant per month. Um, they also have a nice shop that you can, um, I guess, purchase by the plant or the species and they have a beautiful accessories, um, tab also where you can buy all the cute little pots to eventually, uh, replant your succulents. They have over 200 varieties and they are handpicked each month so that you don't receive the same species, I guess, two months in a row, which is nice. And what I like about succulents is that they live longer and they take less time of your time to care for. You can cancel um, at any time, according to their website. You can reschedule or skip deliveries, which is great. If you know you're going to be getting a delivery and you're going to be on vacation, you could reschedule it or skip a month. Um... It does state on their website for summer and winter deliveries. They do give you some options, I guess, with the extreme cold and the extreme heat. I live in an extreme cold state, um, which is great because they offer some kind of a hot pack that I guess you can purchase to put in with your plants, I guess, so that they, you know, don't arrive, you know, maybe frostbit because we all know, you know, the shipping areas, if it's coming by plane or by truck, are cold. Um, this company has high reviews. Every review I saw was a five-star review, um, which tells me a lot. Um, what else did I want to tell you? They are active, very active on social media, on Facebook, Pinterest, Instagram, I think Twitter, and there are a lot of reviews and unboxings on YouTube if you wanted to go watch any of those. I'm trying to think if there was anything else. Um, I will post below in my description box a code and it is love plants and on your first order you can save 15 percent so what i'd like is if you're looking for a different subscription box based you know upon all the subscription boxes that are out there and included on my channel that are usually beauty or hair care skin care stuff like that that this would be a great alternative if you are a plant lover or even if you're a beginner, because these are very easy to care for. So this is the code, and that's your 15% off. And this is your care instruction card that you receive with your box, which is nice. And then in the box, you receive, depending upon how many plants you received, I they had sent me four, which was very nice of them for review. And in there, or I'm just trying to get them all in my hand at one time here. Set so four little cards, which tells you each a little bit about each plant in the box. And, you know, I'm not even going to try to pronounce these because I will not be able to. Um, I love plants, but if you tell me it's a daisy, I'm going to say it's a daisy. I'm not going to give you the long, the long name. Impossible for me anyway. Um, I These came this evening, so I did... Um, they did come well packaged. They were on their sides. They had tons of the, you know, the packing peanuts on top. I did want to open it and get them acclimated. So I did open each individual so that air could get to them. Um, I wasn't sure if I was going to get to this video tonight. So I didn't want any problems with my plants here because they are beautiful. So this first one here, I'm going to show you each plant. And like I said, they are well, well packaged. You will have no problems with these plants. And it's like a little two and a half by two and a quarter, two and a half 
you know, size potting plant. And I think they do suggest you leave them in these for, you know, a week or so just to let them acclimate and, you know, get used to your environment and, you know, I guess maybe de-stress from shipping. So that's that one. And I'll put it right there. And I do believe that one is this, this plant right here. Okay. So that's that one. I'll try to catch that there. Of course, my dog's going to bark right when I want to tape. So then the second one, a little bit of the soil has, you know, gotten on the top, which is fine. I'll just lightly dust that off. But it came in a different, like a terracotta, you know, uh, still plastic with the coloring. So that's a beautiful one also. Um, I, have, I, have, I have had succulents in the past. I think I got these cards wrong. No, that card is right. And that one is this one right here. In the past, and they're extremely easy to take care of. Um, you really don't have to do much, you know, just every once in a while. I do believe with succulents, they do take their water intake from the bottom. You don't water them from the top. So getting them in a, some kind of a planter with a little dish underneath um, is probably the best way for them. You know, windowsill in the nice, you know, temperatures. You know, I won't be able to put these on the windowsill here just because our weather is, is a little chilly. It's in the 30s and 40s, and I don't think they would survive. So I'll keep them away from the window, but they do need sunlight. So that's that one. And then this one was wrapped even better than the others because of its height. So I didn't take the inner paper, I guess, to help secure this so that it didn't, you know, fall over. But that, that one's beautiful also. So I received that one. And then this card matches that plant so like i said you know there's extremely extremely well wrapped i have no complaints about the packaging um i think she contacted me like the end of november maybe around a little after thanksgiving i'm really not 100 percent sure on that um it did take a little bit to get here but then there was no mail one day because of um I think the president, a former president died, so there was no mail. So I don't know if that delayed it by a day or so, but they did arrive today in perfect condition. No problems. None of them look damaged or, you know, any worse for the wear because of, you know, maybe staying out in the cold a little bit longer. So um, I will let them acclimate before, you know, for probably for a week or two, I will get them in little dishes so that they, um, you know, you only water, you know, give them water when they're dry which, you know, if you have a little bit of water in there, it'll take it as it needs it. So um, just don't overwater really any plant, but these especially, because you just put a little bit in and they'll take it as they need it and uh, they will thrive. And what I love on this um, site, website, is the accessories they sell. They have a little um, succulent potting toolkit and they have of a, a nice variety of the little planters, you know, from your simple terracotta little pots with the dish to real, to others that are super fancy to your fancy little, you know, white ceramic -y, you know, bunnies and rhinos and stuff like that, which I think is adorable. Um, like I said, I will be keeping these away from our window cells only because we are in 30 and 40 degree and lower now that we are coming into winter. I live in the state of Pennsylvania. So these won't be able to go anywhere near the windowsill until, you know, the spring and the summer and probably into the fall. But in the winter months, I'll have to keep them away, but still allow them to get light. Um, so I am very pleased with this um, subscription box. This is definitely something that I would order on my own and especially saving 15% off my first box. I do believe the four, I'm trying to think if I wrote down the price. The, so if you got four of the succulents, it was $20. I think it was $20 um, if you paid every month for the four. Um, if I didn't want to get four every month, you know, I think getting two would be fine. That's $10 a month, but I like getting the four. But I guess if you start piling up too many succulents, you, know, you can give them as gifts. Um, and I like that you can, where did I, I wrote it down? I have little notes here, that you can reschedule or skip a delivery. Um, so that if you you know, all of a sudden, if you're getting the four, and I'm sure that you could probably um, email them, like if you get the subscription for the four every month and you find that you're just, it's too many plants, too many plants that you could reduce it down to the three or the two a month or um, take two of your plants each month and give them to a family member or a friend or 
whatever. There's plenty of people. I, you know, every, everybody loves to receive flowers. Well, why not receive a plant that won't die after a week or two? That's something that you could potentially have for a very, very long time if, you know, if you're careful with them. And like I said, this was sent to me for review. I did not buy this. And my reviews are my own opinions. If I was not happy with this or did not like anything in the box, I would say so. And uh, this is something that I am definitely going to look into in the future. And I would almost love to gift this to a few people that I know in my life that love plants that maybe can't get outside to, you know, garden. Um, that they could take care of their plants and still have their plants inside with them. So this is my review for this box, and this is succulentsbox.com, and this is a monthly subscription. And thank you for watching, and have a great day. Bye.